as you can see there are three pieces of cakes and four guests how can we share the three pieces of cakes among the four guests equally let's cut them into four equal parts I will just try to draw as approximately or as close to make it equal now you can see that we have divided one piece taken up first one piece divided into four parts let's distribute them to the guests one piece goes to this person second goes to him third goes to him and the fourth piece goes to him all the four guests are now happy now what should we do with the other piece let's do the same thing we divide that into four equal pieces again one two three four okay now once we have divided into four equal pieces again we can give each one one piece to each one of them if it goes here goes to him and one of these posts to him the third again we do the same thing divide it into four equal pieces and give one piece to each of the guests let's go back and check how many pieces of sweets do each of the guests receive for example guest number one is getting one here one piece from here another piece from here so each of the guests they are receiving three sweets or three pieces of the cake there are a total of four guests each of them are receiving three pieces of cake so in total how many pieces have we got we have got a total of 12 pieces and each guest receives three of them we had three pieces of cake and we had to divide it between four or among four guests equally so that each one of them receive the same amount or the same number of pieces of cakes so what we actually did was divided each of the pieces into four parts or four pieces and gave one to each one of these four guests over here so what we have been doing is three times four which gave us 12. the concept behind is what we call as lcm we were trying to find out the lowest common multiple of three pieces and four guests and how did it work out right let's write down the multiples of three three times one is three three times two is six three times three is nine and three times four is twelve and it goes on for the multiples of four we have four times one is four four times two is eight four times three is twelve four times four is sixteen now when you look at that it's very evident that the first multiple that is common for both three and four is twelve so we divided the cakes into twelve pieces and we gave 
each of the guests, each of the four guests, three pieces. And thus we have divided three pieces of cakes equally among four guests.